Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm here with another video. This video is really fun and exciting because it involved me going shopping, which I love to do. Um, I've done a little too much shopping. I mean, what's new? Honestly, I deal with getting down in the dump sometimes and the only thing that seems to really like fix my mood is to either online shop or like go into the store and pick up some new clothes which I already have way too many clothes and I'm thinking of starting a depop because your girl don't even wear half of this stuff but comment below if that's something you'd be interested in I don't really know um but yeah it's fall time and I'm wearing some festive lipstick I'm just going to show you some of the things I got for fall time. So Matthew, my boyfriend, always tells me that I need to get more practical clothing, more everyday wearable things because he says all my clothes are just a little too extra and crazy. I can never really style them with anything, which is very true. I always get super crazy prints and colors and sheer things and just like different crazy materials and stuff because I just love that. I love fashion and I love crazy stuff. But on this trip, I was trying to tone it down and it is getting pretty chilly outside. Um, today was the first day in like a week that it was actually kind of hot, which I was living for. But <clears throat> I know from now on, it's going to be getting cold and chilly and it has been. So I decided to get some practical, casual, for me at least, um, fall going into winter clothing so yeah um please check out my last few videos and if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe that'd be awesome i would love for you guys to join my little family i'm trying to build so so everything in this haul pretty much except for maybe like one or two things are gonna be from burlington so i do work at burlington and I freaking love it. It's probably my favorite place I've ever worked. Um, everyone there is so genuine and so nice and so wonderful. And the company itself is so great. But anyways, I do markdown sometimes and I find cute stuff when I'm doing it. So pretty much almost everything I bought is from the clearance. So, alright, so the first thing, I know it's striped, but that's okay because it's still super wearable is this long sleeve sweater material shirt so this one's in a size large and i just thought it was so cute and i've been really into y2k recently like that's my new favorite fra like fashion trend and i've been really like kind of wanting to start styling my outfits y2k themed and stuff and i don't really have like I don't know, I just want to start incorporating more pieces like that, and I feel like this style of sweater is kind of Y2K looking, so, and the colors are just so cute. This, by the way, was $7.99, and I also got 30% off, so, so cute. I love this so much. The material is actually super thick and really nice. So, the same type of shirt, same material, but just a different color, and green has been my favorite freaking color for the past, like, three months. So, when I saw this, I freaked out. Again, it's just that sweater material, long sleeve, super cute. This one was actually $6.99 plus the 30% off, so I really loved that one. And the great thing about these shirts is you can either wear them as cardigans opened up with something underneath or what I'm going to do is wear them just as shirts because they're super cute. Alright, so the next one was kind of an impulse buy. <laughs> it really reminds me of Velma off Scooby-Doo. So it's just this turtleneck and you can't tell me this is not just Velma in a shirt. <laughs> and I don't really know what I want to be for a Halloween Halloween yet so I thought this was a cool choice and if not a couple towns down there's always this Scooby-Doo van mystery van that's like parked in this parking lot and honestly I could just take a ball mask Instagram photo wearing this but at the same time I do think this is really cute and it's a little bit of a thinner material but it's still like a sweater material long sleeve 
and this one actually wasn't on clearance but it was only $7.99 so like that's awesome and it's just cropped and super cute so I got that one this okay so I've been looking everywhere for a cheetah print cardigan because I went to this boutique um a while ago and they had one for actually super cheap and I psyched myself out because I was like I don't need it no I'll find it I'll find it somewhere cheaper and I haven't but this one was at my store and it's so cute I have like a love-hate relationship with like the fuzzy look but I like the cheetah print and I'm not gonna lie I mean I kind of like the fuzzy look but I just thought this was such a cute cardigan and I actually got it in a size medium and it was 30% off $19.99 but it's super oversized which I love my cardigans to be oversized. This is so cute. Okay, so the next thing is the thinnest shirt I got. Super thin, but it's just this pink color and it's off the shoulders so it shows a lot of chest and shoulders which I think is super flattering and I love this color I just got a sweater this color not too long ago it's like right there and it's just so pretty and I also really love the like I don't know what it's called turtle something like turtle marvel I don't know but the buttons and I mostly just bought it because it was super flattering. And this one was also not on sale, but it was only $6.99. And then the 30% off. So I thought that one was cute to wear and maybe throw in like a cardigan like this over it just to keep you warmer. Then I bought myself some socks. And I just got the black ones because at work, these are the ones I wear. And I always lose socks. I don't know why. So this is the bag from today. I wasn't planning on buying anything, but again, I was doing markdowns and I saw such cute things go on sale. And it's literally the beginning of fall time and we're marking down sweaters and like long shirt, like long sleeve shirts and stuff. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna pick some up while they're cheap and on sale and like current to the weather. Like that makes sense. So the one I was most excited for was this. So it's like a waffle knit, I guess. Knit, waffle knit. I don't know why I said knit, but waffle knit sweater, cardigan. And they also had my size, but of course I had to get a large because like I said, when I wear stuff as cardigans, I like them to be oversized. It has huge pockets and the buttons look like that. They're so cute. But yeah, I really like this one. And this one, I would not wear like a shirt like the other ones. Just because it has such a deep like V. Like it doesn't button all the way down to like here. So of course it's more like a cardigan style. And I like to keep those open when I wear them. That's why I got it in a larger size. So it's nice and cozy and flowy. So I also got that same exact one in white because this is normally not something I would do but I've been seeing a lot of people getting like white cardigans and stuff and they're super cute and they just look nice and I am just scared of getting it dirty to be honest but whatever it was only $7.99 plus 30% off but same buttons just white waffle knit super cute I really like these so I got that one then sticking with the white, I saw this, and this is a size small, and it was $7.99 as well, but it's just a tighter v-neck knit long sleeve. So this is in between the super thin one and the thicker long sleeve knit. It's more close to the thicker one, but it's not as thick as the others, but I think it's so cute and again I'd wear this one as a shirt and it stretches I know it looks like pinned straight and I have like hips but it actually looks good so I like that one finally this one was just kind of an impulse buy because it was so cheap it was $3.99 plus the 30% off but 
I love my tight little crop tops, you know? And typically this cut on a shirt makes your tatas look nice. But for some reason this one doesn't really like look as flattering as some of the other ones I own from other places. But either way, it's just a gray, simple, form-fitted um, t-shirt. And it's cropped and cute. And it's in a size medium if you are wondering. Now I'm going to go to some things I got at Walmart, accessory wise and something I got off Amazon which I'm so excited about so yeah so again with the whole Y2K fashion style this bottom bracelet just screamed Y2K also ignore my hands I work in fast food too like as well as retail and I always cut my fingers when I do dishes so my fingers look disgusting so please ignore that but this bottom one with the chain and the little heart just looks so Y2K to me. And it also comes with this one and this one. I thought these were so cute. It was $5.88. But like, I love it so much. So then I also saw these, which these are just really pretty and they were $1.50. And I don't really know if you can like see, but there's like so many colors. It's like green and purple and like yellow. I love these. So then, something I'm so excited for, I got this off Amazon. And I have not worn it yet, but I'm way too excited to. So it came in this cute little pouch. And I'm assuming that's the brand, Spinning Daisy. Inside, you get this beautiful necklace. So, this is what it looks like. Isn't this so cute? And this is so 100% Y2K, but also like so my style because I love Playboy. And this is so pretty, like I'm obsessed. Like I wanna wear it every single day of my life. So yeah, I was so t like way too excited to receive that. I think it was like $15, but whatever. It's adorable. I also got some sneakers for the gym because I was really determined, you know, I was telling myself I'm going to the gym every day or every other day, like whatever. And I was doing it for like a week. I was like going at it and then I got so sick. I had the flu and then I got strep right afterwards. And it really demotivated, you know, killed my motivation. And I don't really know why I talk with my hands, but I do, so. Anyways, it really killed my motivation. I'm very sad about it. But I did get two pairs of sneakers. One of them I've already worn so many times. And the other pair is right here, so I'm gonna show you. So both of them are from Pumba. Puma? Pumba. What? But Puma. And this is one of them. So this pair was just super comfortable, honestly. I'm not a huge fan of the style of them. Um, just because this part, I don't know, I just, I'm not feeling it, but these were literally the comfiest shoes I've ever put on in my life. So I just went ahead and bought them because they were so comfortable. And I think for both of these, I spent like $65 for two pairs of like sneakers. But yeah, so this is like the soft foam one and it's Suba comfortable. I'm really excited to wear these because I have not worn these ones yet. Let me get the other pair. So my boyfriend actually saw these ones and showed me and I love them. So I've worn these ones so much. So again, these are just like the soft foam plus again. So they're just like super comfortable. And I love the tongue right there. And just the color of them. These are like super cute, super me. So got these really excited about it to be honest i really need to go back to the gym i haven't in a hot minute but yeah so these are the two pairs i got and i'm really looking for a knockoff like black matte doc martin shoe because i honestly have so many booties and i'm content with like fall themed fall shoes I just really want some like black Doc Martens so those may be in a future video if I find some that I like at a decent price because I only shop like Clarence and Bargains because yeah 
But anyways, I hope you guys like this little fall haul. I'm really excited about all my clothes I got. And if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up again and subscribe to my channel. I'm sorry if I'm whispering. All my family is like downstairs sleeping. But yes, thank you guys. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.